Well, this is the time of the year that it's just foul. I can't believe I'm making this video to put on the internet because I don't even want anybody to come by my farm right now because it is such a muddy, goopy, shitty mess. It's just impossible to keep clean. And of course, we got a bunch of new snow last night. I, I say a bunch, probably half an inch or something, but it feels like feet at this time of the year. Anyways, we're working hard on these raised garden boxes. We've got about 25 or so built here, as you can see, and there's uh, about 35 or so to go. We actually have sunny skies here, thank God. Although what that means for the next six days is that we're going to be uh, below freezing the entire time. We're not going to have any melt off here uh, until the middle of April. And that really, really, really sucks because I try to treat May as a summer month, which I think you have to do as an Alaskan and certainly as an Alaskan farmer. But as you can see, the piles and piles of snow here are so crazy. I don't see how we're possibly going to have the ground... Um, clear by May, which is when I need to get to work to take care of this farm and uh, really push it along. So I'm just trying to keep my wits together at this time of the year because we're now in our seventh month of winter and it looks like we're going to have eight months of winter this year. And uh, that's, that's pretty difficult. So it's just a goopy mess. I spend most of my days just trying to clean up, try to make the cows as comfortable as possible in the goop and uh, swearing at myself for uh, having calves this time of the year, which is not a mistake I'll make twice, that's for sure. And uh, just trying to push along the spring projects, stacking everything and keeping the greenhouse going and just waiting, waiting, waiting for spring. Breakup sucks, this is awful. And uh, I just need to make it through the next, I don't know, three, four weeks without totally losing my without totally losing my shit and uh so i can really get to work we're going to build a big uh, barn this year and we're going to do a grain thong station and we're going to do a lot of fencing and land clearing and we're going to get areas ready for crops and we're going to build fencing in point mckenzie and we're going to move cows and we're going to build all kinds of things this year push this farm along in a big 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 way uh, there's going to be five or six guys plus me plus the family so we have a lot of labor this year we got a lot of big projects planned making the pads for the grain bins and uh this farm is going to be greatly expanded if and only if the goddamn snow will go i'm i'm gonna go have a drink